I guess I'll just call it Max White Presents. Max White, everyone! This is another thing I want to speak about. You just reminded me of something. You know how I said, like, when I grew up, I always felt like I was meant for a higher purpose? And I always felt like, you know, I never spoke about this except for one kid in, like, fourth grade. And we both, like, connected on it. He goes, he, he was, like, one of my best friends. He goes, yo, you know, I always felt like I was, like, the chosen one. And I was like, oh, my God, me too. Because, I, like, I always felt like that. And I never told anyone because I probably knew at the time that that sounds insane. But, um, but I always felt like, and I know that sounds so grandiose and narcissistic. That's why I wouldn't even tell anyone that. But as a kid, I don't feel like that now. I feel like I got a bunch of luck. I got very lucky. But as a kid, I felt like, like I'm the chosen one, even though there's, there's nothing signifying that. If anything, I'm the, there's nothing signifying that. Like the, the, the way we lived, we lived in a bathroom that we shared, um, before i'm not sure if it was before or after uh yeah after that home that i told you about that we lived um amongst the other families we moved right next door where we lived in a room and that room was private it was just a room it was like a studio it was tiny but it was five of us in there but we shared the bathroom with the building like a dorm you know and that bathroom People would just come in, like drug addicts would come in to the building, like people that didn't even live there. So in that bathroom, it was like a, a standing stall. Every now and we had to wear slippers to take a shower there because we were, we, my mom always made us because she's like, you're going to catch fungus if you don't wear slippers. So in that bathroom, you would see heroin needles and condoms. And whenever we saw that, we would just tell our mom, like, mom, there's a needle, like take it out. And then she'd take it out. Um, so yeah, what kind of kid thinks he's the chosen one after that? Like that's what's going on. So... I don't know if it was like car cartoons that I watched or like, you know, stuff that I watched, but I, that's what I thought about myself. So, um, I guess I'll just call it Max White Presents. <laughs>